As you can see by the short little unboxing video there that I figured I'd include instead of doing a separate unboxing video and then doing the first impressions I figured why not mate them together so you know what's coming up that is Shannon Soap's F Mel cannot wait to get into this one so we're just gonna get right on into the misting with the bougie mister get a little bit of pre-shave on the face two days of growth we're going to get ready to rock and roll. Actually recording this on Friday. You guys are going to watch it on uh, Saturday when I release it. Uh, I had a whole completely different shave planned for today. Um, and then I was checking tracking numbers because I have a couple things on the way. And they seen this was uh, waiting at the post office. And I was like, oh yeah. Yeah, no, I, I need to... Uh, I need to record my video today because I cannot wait to use this soap and I might as well just do the video and uh, get my first impressions of it on the screen and very excited for this so the background on this is it's a it's a tribute tribute soap uh, for Mel from pbs.live uh, Brian and Shannon are huge supporters of the Instagram live shows um, they're always there watching the uh, BBS.live, they're always watching us on the Canadian Mafia, and they've sent stuff to the Mafia members as well, each and every one of us, which is incredible, including customized stickers, which was really, really awesome, and uh, just really, really good people, super supportive, so uh, they did this up for Mel, and it, uh, <laughs> it's really funny, <laughs> if you look closely at the label, well, actually, let me get another Shannon's out, tell me... Tell me what you spot different in the label. So there's Mars, there's FML. What do you notice? Yeah, that one. He's got a pair of glasses, <laughs> just like Mel's glasses. So, you know, it's little touches like that that are really, really, really cool. So we are going to get into this. I have not sniffed this. I unboxed it, I haven't smelled it. So the, the initial sniff is gonna be here on camera. Gonna be loading up with the uh, Spiffo Jackson 26 millimeter high mountain white badge. All right, let's get into this. This is Mel's absolute favorite cologne based on Salvatore Ferragamo F Black. Ooh, oh yeah, that's nice. Yeah, that's really nice. Oh, I like that. I like that a lot. All right, let's get this loaded up. We'll go over the set notes. So, F Black has labdamum and tonka bean in the base. The uh, heart notes are, I think it's the heart notes, are lavender and apple. And then there's black pepper and coriander. So a little spicy, a little lavender-like. A little bit of sweetness from that vanilla. Yeah. This is nice, this is real nice. I can see why this is Mel's favorite cologne. I'm digging it. We'll get right in here and get a good load on the brush. This is the Chupacabra base, which uh, is a fantastic base. At least I'm pretty sure it's the Chupacabra. I don't have my glasses on, I can't read the, uh, I can't read the label, I don't think. I'm pretty sure that says Rust Belt Reserve, which is Chupacabra. 
So it's got to be anyway. I think anything in those tubs is rust belt slash chupacabra. So let's get it onto the face. One of my current favorite bases on the go right now. I really do like Shannons. I'm starting to amass a stockpile of Shannons. And I do not have a problem with that. Oh yeah, that's really nice. Definitely getting the lavender. But it's not like uh it's not like a super punchy, like sickly sweet lavender. Those spices and the black pepper are definitely kind of toning the brightness of the lavender down a bit. Scent strength is a good solid medium, it's not super strong. It's not super weak either. So I would put it right in the middle. I know this uh, this is gonna take no time at all to lather up. So we're gonna do the quick face lather on camera just for you guys. Might even be cheeky and steal Brian's tagline. Oh yeah, that's really good. Really, really good. And I'm really excited to try the splash because like everything in wet shaving, and I've said it a bunch and I'll continue saying it, I know there's some people out there that, you know, a lot of times they'll buy the soap and they don't buy the matching splash. If you can swing it, you owe it to yourself to buy the splash. And the reason being is soap bases can distort the scent of a frag sometimes. So you're still, you're going to get a little bit of base influence off the soap base. The true representation of the frag is usually always in the splash. So... You know, if you really want that full experience, I would highly recommend getting the matching set. And, you know, if you don't like it and it's not your bag, well, this set has a better resale uh, appeal anyway. Because uh, most wet shavers will buy everything in a set. So, uh, if you do buy something and it's not to your liking, you do have an easier time moving it along if you have the matching set. As opposed to just just the soap and uh yeah that lather came together real quick real nice um one could almost say look at it just look at it i'll do a frag spray for you on the next uh, mafia show brian just to uh <laughs> just just for payment for stealing your tagline but yeah that's a that's a great lather oh yeah look at that nice sheen nice creaminess all right We'll get on with the shave now. Video might run a little bit longer than usual. But that's okay. I'm going to include chapters down below. So if you want to if you want to skip ahead, then you can uh, skip to whatever part of the video that your uh, heart desires. If you want to watch the whole thing, then that's uh, that's cool too. We uh, we have options around here in the Red Island Shave Den. Now that we're actually into the shave, it shouldn't take too long. Going with the Schick Golden 500, also known as the GOAT 500, uh, for the uh, BBS.Live Singles Week 2. And basically, Singles Week, use a single-edged razor. So, a vector, a hawk, an injector, shave it straight. If it's got a single edge, and go ahead and use it, post it up on Instagram. Make sure you at bbs.live with the hashtag singlesweek2. And uh, one of the boys will share your shave of the day and their story. And yeah, I absolutely love this razor. Three shaves on a chic yellow box blade. So so nice, and I love the gold. I really have a, I really have a thing for gold razors. Actually, I was watching the Razor Emporium video today about uh, restorations, and <laughs> the wheels got turned. And I have a razor. I don't know. I don't know if we'll do it. If we'll pull the trigger, but I, I'll have to send a message to Matt because I think I think he can replate anything, uh, not just Gillette's. So I have an idea for something. I'm not saying what razor out of my collection I may be thinking of, but there might be one getting plated in 24 karat gold. So we'll see. We'll see. I have to save up some uh, some more affiliate money maybe and put it towards a, 
a gold plated razor that would be sweet because I really love I really love gold razors I don't it's just they're shiny they're pretty I like them all right get into this across the green yeah super slick soap this razor is just gliding I'm really enjoying this lavender scent very calming very relaxing I'm instantly in a good mood um, yeah I was already in a pretty good mood today I'm really in a good mood must be all that lavender goodness and this shave is going really nicely we're just flying right through it now and uh, you know that's what you get with a with a high quality soap great razors some good face prep yeah well, that lather is still still able to peak up if I want it and bulk up yeah very nice Get a real good coat on for this uh, this last pass. This is the tricky one. Lather held up nicely in the brush with that quick face lather. Oh man, really, really, really enjoying this. All right, this is the this is the money pass we like to call it in the in the biz. And this is where that shave just becomes money. go that's good I'm not gonna do much more buffing than that I'll tell you these uh, injectors with their rigid blades PBS machines perfect that's good there get the other side very intuitive angle on the uh, on the Gold 500 too. It's very easy to shave with. This is the only injector I own. Now some are more aggressive, some are more mild. This one seems like it's a it's a good middle of the road injector. It's not like super aggressive, but it's not super mild either. It's just it's kind of like just right, at least just right for me. And it really does work really really well. All right, a little bit of a angle here towards the ear that gets these pesky hairs I want to go for mostly BBS over here yeah that'll do it that'll do it a little bit of finesse work goes a long long way quick rinse splash application and we're going to get you guys out the door onto your weekend. Oh. You know, I do appreciate you guys taking time out of your busy weekend to uh, spend some time with me here in the den. It's always appreciated. Love interacting with you guys in the comments. Makes my day. Makes me feel good. And if you would consider hitting that subscribe button down in the... Uh, the top right hand corner on your device and then uh, that would be muchly appreciated too and that was a fantastic shave mm -mm 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 -mm. feeling good yeah there's that there's the chupacabra base post shave feel skin feels nice and hydrated just the way we like it all right let's get into the splash gang like I said this will be the true representation of Salvatore Ferragamo F black Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah. All right, a very big lavender pop. Good bit of coriander on that splash, too. A little bit of that black pepper. So a little spiciness. Mmm. Yeah, put a little bit more of that stuff on. That's some good juice. Oh yeah, we're gonna smell good today. We're gonna smell good today. Uh, I'm gonna hold Shannon's responsible if I end up breaking a kitchen table later on. So that's okay. It'll be good for it. 
Won't they? I know you will. All right, gang. Well, that's the shave. Thanks so much for tuning in. Do appreciate it. Hopefully, you guys have a most fantastic weekend. We're going to catch you on the next one. So, this is me, J Mac, signing out. And uh, have a good one. Be safe. Be kind to one another. Have a great day. Need a better shave. Catch the next one. Peace.